Hi guys, in this tutorial I want to show you how to do weapon system with physic, with animation and that stuff. So, um, you need to create a blueprint with actor, then uh, call it weapon base or weapon master, then create cow blueprint. Uh, and make a uh, uh, create uh, interface blueprint interface for your weapon. Open it and create function add weapon, move weapon, and drop weapon. For add weapon and drop weapon, you need to create inputs character and so for socket name variable, uh, for drop weapon you don't need this. So then we open weapon class, base weapon class, open uh, class setting, at uh, pick up weapon, blueprint interface um, is this one. So then we co even add weapon set physical asset function for your skeletal mesh. Uh, we using skeletal mesh for this weapon system uh, and uh, create variable for take physical asset. Uh, then we need reset relative transform. Set collision profile name in head weapon. Uh, you don't have this uh, at start. Uh, you need to do this uh, collision profile, create this pro collision profile, and then you attach actor to component. And important, you need to have. Uh, target is actor. So uh, then you need to do uh, create even drop. So create set physical asset for drop physical asset. Create variable reset relating transform to and set collision profile name drop weapon. Uh, then you need detach. For actor, target is actor too, and keep world, keep world, keep world for attaching snap to target. So how to do collision profiling? You need to open project setting, then collision, preset, and new two times drop weapon. For drop weapon, you need to object type pawn. For collision enable last one and um, something like this, uh, but you can block all. I uh, block all without power and we have. So then uh, you need in hand weapon. For in hand weapon, you need uh, make object type physical body and collision enable. Uh, to the last one. So uh, for collision response, uh, you can uh, click here, ignore all, all of this, and accept to creating this uh, profile, this preset. So uh, that's all for uh, weapon base. Uh, weapon master blueprint. Then we open your child for uh, for this uh, for this uh, blueprint class, and you have these two variables. So you have a basic physical asset for your uh, weapon. So you need to duplicate this and. Open, click here for your collision and 
uh, turn on cinematic type for your in hand weapon when you take it you have in hand it and you don't need to move this weapon uh, or you don't need your physic in hand you need only physic uh, when you drop this weapon so for kinematic for kinematic asset you need to uh, uh, to paste it here and for default physical type like this default you need to paste it when drop physical asset that's all for your child uh, you need to open ah yeah for collision profile for this uh, you need same name with uh, with uh, this function so then we open your character you need make a sphere trace for object for object type you need pawn because when we take this weapon in hand we have uh, dynamic, uh, dynamic, sorry, I don't remember how it goes. Ah, oh, uh, it is, ah, no, I, I have a physical body. And when we have pawn, this weapon, you can take it. When you have a physical body, you can take this because uh, he can take only pawn. So, then we make a branch with it, uh, we make uh, we create a hit result then from message drop from uh, from interface and then we make we create a variable hit actor then connect with drop weapon it is important uh, it must be like this and uh, create a message add weapon for uh, uh, for character you will need make a cell then socket name your own weapon socket then uh, you use this uh, I'm using this socket and this socket for this tutorial uh, and create a montage uh, for your group like animation of equipping this weapon okay then uh, for your inputs your in I have K1 and Z and 1 uh, and 2 so for move weapon for message move weapon we need to hit actor to target and self to character and then socket name the same with setting this weapon uh when you equip this weapon we have weapon slot and the same with uh first key and second key we have a move weapon and uh the same with first one uh but socket name you use rifle so it is very simple you can uh, do this for your multiplayer game and it is work 